Hello everyone, it's NYC back with another YouTube video. In today's video, I'm gonna be doing a day in the life at City College. It is currently three right now. I'm an hour early to my class and I figured, hey, with this free time, I could probably show you guys around campus, show you all the useful stuff because honestly, there aren't a lot of videos on YouTube about this. And so I figured, hey, you know, I could use my platform and since I go to this school, I can make this video. There are about like five videos, I think, on YouTube right now. And honestly, none of them really do, in my opinion, a great job at showing around campus and showing like all the useful things that I feel like newcomers would really need to know. Hopefully you guys find this video useful. This video is also partially inspired by my interaction with a freshman. They kind of like, you know, asked me, hey, like, where do you get your student ID? And like, where do you go for like email help and all that stuff? You know, I showed them around and stuff. And so yeah, this video is inspired by that. I, I figured I could probably show you guys around like the library and the cafeteria and all those places that I feel like every college student should know. I'll also be showing you guys the NAC building because my class is in the NAC building and that's infamous for just being such a crazy building. It's so hard to navigate and just, yeah, I'll talk about it more when we're there. See you guys on campus, peace out. through 135th Street and Convent Avenue. And so right now I'm gonna show you the Marshack Building. So yeah, this is the Marshack Building, Robert E. Marshack Science Building. This is where you'll have all your science classes and the entrance is through there. And of course, like every other building, you're gonna to have to show your ID. Honestly, these buildings right here are like the most beautiful of the campus. And this is the infamous Knack Building. I dread this building. Every time I enter here, it's just awful. It's just really hard to navigate. Windows, they're not actually glass. They're made out of like, I think, plastic. And I know that through taking the, taking an architecture class over there where the architecture school is at. Took one course of that and the professor was just like, yeah, this building is just awful. Um, I'll do, I'll show you guys more of that when I get closer, so. Right now, I'm just gonna show you the rest of the campus. So now we're approaching the Howard Administration Building. The building right here is where you get all your financial aid questions answered, just all that stuff. If you're a freshman, this is like the first place you're gonna come to. So yeah, on to the next thing. Look at how nice this place is. The design is just amazing. This is definitely like my favorite part of the campus. It's very beautiful, very beautiful design. And you can just hang out here in the grass if you'd like, you know, there's people hanging out and stuff. Funny thing about this is that this was the original entrance to the campus, but then ever since they made the expansion to add the NAC and all the other stuff, this kind of just sticks out like a sore thumb. You have these beautiful arches and they kind of just stick out, which is a shame. Entrance is closed. Bruh. I'm not sure if it's a permanent uh, closure or anything like that, but you used to be able to go right in there to get to your classes. This is, I believe, the Shepherd Hall. I'm approaching uh, another entrance to this building, and it's most likely the one you're going to use when you come here. Right there, it's another entrance. 259 Convent Avenue. That's another entrance with the arches. That one, the campus does not extend that way on St. Nicholas Avenue. That's where I was over there showing you the closure of that entrance and this is the other entrance. So hopefully you find that useful. So this, from my understanding of like the four years I've been here, I'm pretty sure this is a high school. A lot of those high schoolers share the cafeteria in the NAC building which is a damn shame because, you know, you'd be thinking to yourself, yeah, I came to college to escape that high school life or whatever. No, sorry, buddy. There's gonna be high schoolers here. 
Some of you may not mind, but honestly, when I was a freshman, I did mine heavily, because I'm like, I really want to escape that high school life. Heading to the NAC building, aside from it being like a really horrible building to be in, it has useful stuff. But so this is the main entrance. Taking out my ID, because that's required. There you go. <laughs> you see my ID? Did you see it? Yeah. I don't know what he said. So here is the NAC building. That over there, that's where you get your ID and you renew it every year. Um, on your student ID, you usually get like this little sticker and every semester you basically get a new one that says the semester that you're in and you need that. At least for me, when I was a freshman, a sophomore, every time I'd enter, they'd give me a huge problem. They'd be like, you need that sticker, you need that sticker. And so, you know, you have to remember to get that. But honestly, when it, you know, we all took remote classes, so that wasn't something you needed to do. And honestly, right now, they kind of don't care. They kind of just want people to get in the building, do their thing. That's just how it is. I'm heading up this escalator and I don't even know where my class is. <laughs> and here is the library. So right here is the Morris Raphael Cohen Library. People just call it the Cohen Library. Also, over here is the, sorry, you can get your breakfast and it's just like a little cafe thing. Vending machines um, and the cafeteria. I think I'll do that before I head to my class. This is the cafeteria. You can eat your outdoor lunch here. They don't mind, they don't care. I don't know if any college cares. That's where you get your food. Maybe you can go in really quickly. Although, I don't know because I don't like filming people when they're eating, but yeah, that's where people eat. They have a few vending machines here. I don't think I've ever bought anything from here. Honestly, just go to the deli. It's way better, it's way cheaper. CCNY, please don't go after me for saying that. They have drinks, a lot of cool stuff. ATM, which doesn't work. I didn't know that, never knew that. What is this? Farmer's fridge. I don't know what this is. I've never seen that before. Reminder, just go to the store. It's probably cheaper. And the scaffolding. I don't know what they're working on. They're always working on something in this school. Oh, this is one other thing that I wanted to tell you guys. These escalators suck so much because they're always like breaking down. Yeah, these escalators are always breaking down. Surprisingly today, they're in service. <laughs> Here is kind of like what bridges between what bridges the two buildings. You can barely see out of the window. It's because these are made out of like, I think plexiglass or something, I don't know. But yeah, this is the bridge, connects the two buildings. Uh, if you're like me, who messes up where I need to be going, who kind of gets confused, you're gonna be seeing this bridge quite a lot. And this is my school right here. The School of Education. It turns out I am actually way earlier than I thought. Um, currently looking for my class. Oh yeah, I'm gonna show you guys what I'm talking about. In the NAC building, you're gonna see this, these signs. At first glance, you're like, well, Brandon, that's not that difficult. But when you're in a rush and you see this, my mind jumbles. Honestly, my mind just jumbles. I'm just like three, two, uh, and I get confused and I get lost. The whole building is kind of like this. Sometimes you'll see plaques like this, like like signs and stuff, which is kind of better. It looks better. It's easier to see, but yeah, not all of the building looks like that. Kind of sounds like I'm bashing this place a lot, but it's a good place. NAC has a, has a lot of good stuff. Oh, right. I should show you the, what was the one thing I didn't show you guys? I think it was like the computer lab. So we're gonna go there. Sorry, sorry, <laughs> sorry. This place, honestly, if you have any like concerns with emails, like how to sign in and all that stuff, because you honestly need like two emails. But you're gonna wanna go here and this is the place where they can help you with all that stuff. Because when I was a freshman, I had so much trouble with it. I didn't know who to go to. I'd always ask other students and sometimes they wouldn't know. So if you go to this place, they'll get everything situated for you. They'll, they'll resolve all of your problems when it comes to like emails and logging into the school's website and all that stuff. So I'm gonna show you guys that right now. Jazz? 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 Jazzlyn? Hi. Is that you? Yeah, 
I'm making a video right now. Oh shit, hi. Yeah. I'm just showing around the campus Bye. for freshmen. Wait, is this for you too? Yeah. Oh, I like, I watch your videos. Oh, really? Yeah, you yeah, do? Yeah, because you post them. Oh, that's so cool. You met that's Kelly, so great. Right? Yeah, I met Kelly. I just met an old classmate. I knew her since like freshman year. We were just talking, uh, catching up a bit. Oh yeah, I have to show you guys the computer room. <laughs> so this is the entrance, right? This is where I told you where the ID is at and all that stuff. And this is the escalator that goes up. And as a quick refresher, library's here and the cafeteria is like back there. And so here, you see this right here? This tells you where everything's at. Uh, City College Center, City Technology Center, I can't read. Room 1301. Wait, I might be mistaken. Might not be able to go through there. Oh, thank you so much. <laughs> Sorry about that. Oh no. I did the same mistake last time I came here. So yeah, this was an entrance, but it's no longer the entrance, I guess. But it might be an exit. So if you wanna go into where all the computers are at, the printers and all that stuff and print something out, definitely come here, it's very useful. I would go through the library right now to show you, but I don't want them to kick me out of there, so. Not gonna do that. Just taking a quick break, I walked a lot. I mostly showed you guys around the NAC building, but honestly, it's the one that deserves a tour the most just because of how hectic it can be in here and how easily lost you can get. Some, may, some people watching this may disagree with me, but honestly, I've never gotten used to the NAC building. Even some professors have admitted to getting lost, um, which is quite funny. But, you know, sometimes it's their first year, just like, you know, students and stuff or you know, it's only their second, third year. They're still haven't gotten used to it, which makes sense. I'm gonna head to my classroom right now. I'm gonna show you my classroom. It'll be my first time entering there, so it'll be a surprise for both of us. Uh, another example of escalators not in service. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> it's always a workout. <sighs> oh, hello, hi. Oh, okay, all right. <laughs> I had somewhere more quiet, but yeah, made it to my class. I couldn't sit there. I thought I could chill out for a bit. I usually is allowed, but you know, the teacher's just sitting up and stuff, so I'm gonna just be hanging out here. So I just got out of class. It went really good, actually. Oh, it's gonna be super dark outside. So yeah, I just got out of class. Class is super good, super chill t uh, professor. I was about to say teacher, high school habits. But I just wanted to make this quick, I guess, closing to the video. Um, if there was anything that you guys wanted to see but I didn't show off, my apologies. Um, I don't know if this video is successful. I can make a follow-up to this. I was basically just showing around as much as I could before my class started. And hopefully some freshmen find this video useful. That's it, I'm gonna head home now, peace.